Oh, hey there, people. How the frig's it going in this hazy Saturday afternoon? Oh, man, I'm going to give you guys a tip. I'm going to give you guys a real good tip. If you use melatonin to fall asleep at night, i.e. this shit, which is basically a sleep aid. Yeah, melatonin, 5 milligrams, chocolate mint. I don't know if you're supposed to chew them. I just swallow them. But, um... <sighs> Don't take three of them, okay? Don't fucking do it. Because I did last night, and let me tell you, I couldn't wake up today. It took so much for me to get my ass out of bed, it was ridiculous. God, I love having fast internet. I just bought Battlefield 4 off of the PlayStation Store for 20 bucks. 20 bucks! That's freaking awesome. So that's installing right now, and we'll get her going. Also, this is a really fun game, Magica. It's free right now for PlayStation Plus users, and uh, I recommend it. It's kind of fun. It's goofy, it's hilarious, but it's an awesome game. What a gaming day, people. Today what we're going to do is we're going to head over to Crappy Tire, buy that friction disc for the blower, and then we're going to rip into that son of a whore, and we're going to put a new friction disc in it, because they're calling for a mild winter this year. A mild winter leads to boatloads of snow. Boatloads of snow leads to shoveling. Why the fuck would I want to do that when I just spent a hundred bucks on a blower? Hmm, <clears throat> right? Yeah, we're gonna get that friction wheel, we're gonna get that blower operational, so we're ready for, this, for January and February when the boatloads of snow come in to ruin our day. So, off to the car to inflate some tires probably. But before we go anywhere, I really, 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 really got a rock of shit. She just loves her banky. Sleeps on it all the time now. So, so coat. And then there's this thing. He just wants attention all the friggin' time. Holy shit, is it ever cold out today? It's minus 10. Okay, that tire held air. What's this one look like? Sitting on the ground, flat as fuck? Of course, because that's what it does. Fuck sakes. Anyway, first thing we need to do is get the manual for the blower and see what part it calls for. Because I realize water got into my doorknob. She was stiff to turn. Okay, first off. Oh, that's gonna be a fucking problem, eh? No friggin' light in this damn garage, son of a bitch. Um, I need to find the package. There it is. That came with the blower. Alright, I'm gonna go in the house. We're gonna look this over and see what part number it calls for. Unfortunately, the manual's useless and doesn't tell me what I want to know, but it sort of does because it gives me a part number for the blower. So I'm gonna go look this up and see what it says. And see what I can find. Well, that's for the Tecumseh, though, eh? What's this shit? Operator's manual. So, same nonsense in here. Maintenance, storing, preventing bush, maintenance, California. Well, let's check out maintenance. Let's go to page 13 and see what it says. Maybe it might accidentally have something useful. The fuck is this? Filling the tank. Engine, oil changes to come see how to run it. A bunch of junk. Bunch of junk. Bunch more junk. Um, page 13, maintenance. Doesn't tell me a fucking lick of anything. Garbage. Okay, so I'm going to bring this upstairs. We're going to look this up and see what... Uh, guy we need for this to work because that one from Canadian Tire says it fits all models but I bought stuff in the past that says fits all models and it was all models but the one I owned kind of want to avoid that of course me being stupid I grabbed the wrong fucking manual I grabbed the manual for the motor not for the blower so it's a 600 series blower um, all right let's see what we can find inside of this pig okay so it doesn't really show much it doesn't tell me what part I need because that's awesome it just shows, uh, oh, never mind, that will work. So you just take it apart and compress a new disc in it. All right, onward to fucking crappy tire. Let's go get a new disc. See, it doesn't really say in here, um, up note, if you replace some friction wheel assembly as a whole, discard the worn part, slide the new part onto the hack shaft, follow the steps above. Okay, friction wheel rubber. So 
after 25 hours of operation, periodically thereafter. Drain gasoline, don't need to do that, it's pretty much out. Move lever to R2 position. Okay, tip snow thrower so it rests on the hose. Probably on the actual, like, the chute, like the, uh, the scooper or whatever. Move self-tapping screws from frame cover underneath snow thrower, remove frame cover, blah, blah, blah. Remove right hand wheel by removing the screw and belt washer which secure to the axle, locate the hex shaft and snap ring on the side of the snow thrower about two inches from the wheel axle. Using a suitable tool, carefully remove the outer E ring, which, what the fuck's an E ring? Okay. Slide hex shaft. Remove inner ring from hex shaft. Friction wheel assembly. No, okay. So we're going to go to Crab Tire. We'll buy that ring for 12 bucks. It'll be awesome. So you can tell this kind of shit's not really in my field, but fuck it. Right? And then when we come back, we'll reload the kerosene heater with kerosene. We'll get a fire started in the garage. Not really, just a little little heat, we'll let that place warm up a bit and then uh, we'll tip the stupid son of a bitch up on its head and we'll crack into the bottom and we'll slap on a new ring hopefully we have light by then because if we don't have light we are officially fucked well I can turn on these lights I guess but uh, yeah alright let's go up to the car, fire it up and put some air into those tires probably should put some WD-40 into that handle too car says, well, I just turned the radio off, but, um, car says it's minus three out, but I don't think the car feels wind chill. Forgot to put my wipers up last time I used my car. It's fucked up. Oh, well, we'll get her next time. Anyway, let's get off to cleaning the tire, go pick up that friction disc, and then we'll, uh, install that after. Alrighty, we're, uh, down here at Canadian Tire. Gonna head her inside, see if we can get that part. I said they got like five of them in stock, so we will see what we can find. Alrighty, we got the part. Now let's go home, see if we can figure out some, something to do for lighting in the garage, and then uh, get this bitch installed. I would have filmed inside Canadian Tire, but they got this sticker on the door saying no cameras. I guess they're sick and tired of people filming inside Canadian Tire making a fucking ruckus. Anyway, let's go home. Change of plans. I'm going to get a pizza at, some, at uh, Caesars. And then we're going to go home. We're going to have something to eat. And then we'll tackle the project. Fuck it. Okay, so I ended up getting two pizzas. Reason being is they have a deal where it's eight. Well, it's normally uh, nine bucks for a pizza. And then uh, they had a deal today. Buy two. For 15 so I was like fuck it you know what cold pizza for breakfast tomorrow I like that all right let's get the fuck out of here and go home I want to eat like normally this is supposed to spring back but it's not I don't know what the fuck's going on with this oh whatever I'll squirt some WD-40 in there see what happens but uh, there's the part Set me back about the same amount as the pizzas. Nice. That's all it is. A fucking ring. And it says right on it. Fits 1993 and later models 600D and 668H. And I don't know. If, this is a 600 model. It really doesn't have a fucking part number on it. It just says CD00195. What does it say up here? Probably the same shit. But it is a 600 series, so uh, I'm gonna go eat. We got light. I'm gonna leave them running. Fuck it. We're gonna move my helmet after. We'll fire that bitch up. I found my kerosene. It's like over there um, behind those ramps and shit. So we'll stock up. You can almost see it. We will stock up that on kerosene and we'll kick her over. Let her heat up the garage. Oh, never mind. There's my kerosene right there. Fuck. What the hell was I looking at down there? I don't know what the hell. Anyway, we'll uh, fire that up. One of these nights, I've got to go to the beer store and drop off my empties. i got a whole bunch of these big bottles of beer. But, uh, whatever. So, we'll have to get the mini bike out of the way. Probably just tuck her in there. And I want to get this over to here and get it tilted up so it's getting in the light so we can see if the frig's going on. I also have a shop light around here somewhere. Uh, right there. 
So we'll have light on the subject. That'll be a pretty easy job, I think, but right now I'm too hungry, and when I get hungry, I get shaky, and when I get shaky, I can't even operate a ratchet, so I'm going to go eat and uh, take your phone. Oh, now you want to be spring-loaded? Fucking broken-ass piece of shit. I'm going to buy a new handle next time I'm at Walmart. But, uh, yeah, so we'll grab those pizzas. We'll head her inside. Fuck, when I left, it was all sunny, and now I'm coming back, and it's all darky. Pretty cocked, man. Pretty cocked, man. Alrighty, so for this pizza here, it's a three meat. This is the one I'm going to fuck over tonight. This pizza over here is a Hawaiian. I'm going to save that for tomorrow. Alrighty, pizza's gone. That's right, I fucked over the whole pizza. I knew that was going to happen. They're not big pizzas. It's only like six or eight slices or some nonsense. So, we're going to head out to the garage. And start cracking on that fucking thing. The snowblower. Alrighty, well, the light's charged up a lot, so that's awesome. Alright, let's get some shit moved around here. Then we'll get this blower up on its chute. Should check and see how much gas is actually in it. I don't think there's much. Yeah, there's fuck all in there. Oh, stinks. Stinky gasoline, definitely could use a fresh tank, but okay, let's get the mini bike out of the way. We'll fire that over somewhere and yeah, let's get the shit figured out. I want to get that heater going too. So Adrian showed up. Fucking bright light, Jesus Christ. Sure wanted to talk. What happened? It looks oh, like it's on. Cool. It looks like there's an orb. I didn't even know it was on. But uh, got the uh, snowblower in its famous face down ass up position. Smells funny in here. And so that's kerosene. I spilled, I spilled some kerosene trying to light the heater. Did it go out? I feel really cool. Oh, no. Nope. Ooh, no, it's, <laughs> it's definitely still going. It's on. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. This thing's fucking... Yeah, woof, the garage is gone. Okay. <laughs> All right, we're going to pop this off. So it looks like there's doom. Hmm. This guy, this guy should slide up and release. Might have to take whatever the fuck this thing, this little guide for whatever that lever controls. Your, 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 Ogre? Your go. Yeah, I might have to take that one off to get this cover off, but, huh, fuck, let's just start ripping things off and see what happens. Ooh, there might be, uh, there might be a slit all the way up. Yeah, it's slid it all the way up, so you can just slide right off. Nice. Yeah. All right, so we got this son of a bitch open. Uh, there's your, your, your drive wheel. There's the ring. This is the culprit. Look how brilliant this thing's put together. Fuck belts, eh? <laughs> Straight up gears. Oh my god. Straight out of China, boys. Not really, but probably. Um, okay, so basically to take this off, we're going to have to remove this wheel. Uh, this is going to have to come off, which, fuck if I know what it is. Just looks like I take that bolt out and we're good to go. Slap the wheel off, and then there's this little, what would you call it, C-clamp? Uh, it's a... C-clip? Yeah, what the fuck did I just call it? Snapper. Snappering. So that's got to come off. I don't have the tool to do it, so we're going to improvise. And then, uh, should be able to push this straight through. This side has the same thing holding it, but it'll probably just fall apart. Take that out. Take these four bolts out. Actually, you know what? I might cheat. You might be better. No, no, we got to take it apart. You we might be better off taking this side off, actually, because all this shit right here, that's fixed, isn't it? No, no, that should be able to come off. Like, once we get the the, uh, the axle out, that'll slop right out. Are you pulling the whole axle out? This whole thing has to come out. This whole oh, thing. Oh, that's right, because it's stupid gear. No. Oh, only... hey. Yeah. <laughs> that's fabrication at its finest right there, people. But, uh, no, it's got to come out because i got to put the new ring on, right? Mm -hmm, and... mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So that shaft has got to come out. Got to do it. All right, you gotta go, buddy. All right, well, it's been confirmed that this wheel has never been removed, but now it has, so good. Um, next up is to, well, fuck, we need to uh, take off this clamp and then drop this whole axle out. The other side has a clampy too, so I'm hoping that by releasing this clamp and fucking around with it, this clamp will just fall apart. Then we can get this shit off of here and be done with it. Let's play!
Just gonna make a correction for the vlog because I don't want to get picked on. Those are C clamps. Yeah, those aren't uh, those aren't C clamps. Those are a lot easier to get out. So yeah, you can probably not do it by hand, but uh, I got you, I got these. You can probably you can probably well those can hold it while you fucking punch her out with a hammer. I got those. Just hold it one side. And we'll then. figure it out. Actually, give me a screwdriver, a flathead screwdriver. Okay, freedom. Those. Keep everything together so we have happy times. Uh, you got those needle nose stuff? Uh, put them away. Oh, cool. Let me go fetch them. I'm helping. <laughs> needle nose. Thanks. Oh, yeah. That's not easy to be discon. Oh, Jesus. That's probably gonna fucking just ricochet. Nah. Yeah. No. <laughs> ah, my dice! <laughs> my iris! <laughs> I needed that for visibility purposes. Uh, uh, oh! Owie. I just come here to wreck your shit. Yeah. Sounds like we might have another person in the homestead. Oh yeah? I'm just gonna go take a look through the mail slot because I got a lot of light coming into it. Negative, there's only you out there. Did you see you pinched your hammer? Man. Oh, I thought I heard hammer. I was like, holy fuck, bud. Hi, holy fuck. Hold, Hold on. <laughs> Why don't you work? Fuck, when springs are strong, eh? Oh, yeah, because we're laid off. Oh! <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> <laughs> You ever watch those on Facebook? The ones with the little kids picking it? Oh, basically fucking just giving their parents shit. No. So I think it's about the same people who do Bat Dad. Funny shit. Yay, it's free! I did it! I mean, you did it! Because you're doing it! We did it side by each! Side by each and two by twice. Oh, we do have to take this one off for fuck's sake. What is that one? I don't, uh, how about the other side? What's the other side like? Because we gotta pull this whole thing right here. Ah, fuck my tits. Unless you. I don't really want to fuck with those gears. No, me neither. With the way they, they are. Okay. Bird back. Okay. Dicky do side down. That's the dicky do. That goes. That? that goes down. Oh, okay. So I was gonna say. Dicky down. Dicky down. Yeah. Hopefully. And then that should just separate. Oh, it should. What is being poopy doopy? There's no more bolts in there. No. It's loose. It's just. I need. I need this. <laughs> ow! 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 ow. I've already been stabbed three times today. I went up for Black Friday sales. <laughs> but you're in Canada. Yeah, I know. We just say sorry a bunch. Yeah. And we're really apologetic about things. I laughed because, like, I held the door open for a guy and he said thank you. And it's just, I'm like, I'm not, I don't think it was thankful for it. I think it was more or less just habit. Well, people are still getting over Thanksgiving, so. Well, they're I'm thankful for people holding doors open for me. Like, you hold the door open in America, and if it's a woman, she thinks you're fucking taking away her feminist rights. Yeah. I'm a woman. I can do this on my own. I can hold my own fucking doors, you stupid man. Fuck, I don't need men for anything. No, never have, never will. Why haven't you complimented me? <laughs> Tell me I'm pretty and touch my bum. Um, Is this supposed to come off this way or what? There's no ring. There's nothing. Nothing. That should just pop right off of there, theoretically. <laughs> Alrighty, guys. Well, we already got the new ring on. There's the old ring. There's the new ring. The old ring. And the new ring. Cock ring. Uh, literally, this doesn't separate, so... <laughs> That's a scary fucking cock ring. You just said cock ring. ring. <laughs> well, you yeah. know. It's for an elephant. <laughs> How you doing? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. That's <laughs> My goodness. But uh, Rex 16 <laughs> showed up. Sorry, that's the running I joke right now. Going here. That's, that's the joke. <laughs> um, all I'm going to do now is bolt this back together with the new ring on. We'll clean up the ring with some gasoline and a uh, fucking rag to make sure that none of the grease is on it. And then slap it back in. We should be good to go. And he's totally masturbating. I, I just wanted to make sure it was in the background. Oh. <laughs> okay, so I'm gonna carry on with this shit. <laughs> wow. Anyway, that was a good uh, time to turn the camera on, though. No doubt. So we got the uh, the clips back in, but we fucked up. You see uh, that piece of brass there? Super duper. That's supposed to go inside of that hole to control your speed limiter. But it's not. <laughs> but it's totally not in the hole. So. <laughs> Guess who? Guess what we gotta do? We gotta take. We gotta push the snowblower all winter. 
<laughs> I don't like that idea. No. No. Oh, good no. I'm gonna take these clips off and do this again. Uh, Fuck my dick. Hey. I'm about to fire it up in here at the door. Oh, fire it up. Put a full pin. Shut all the doors. We'll be good. Okay. You got front. You got front door, right? I'm not gonna get inside or anything, but. Grab the wire. Pull. Grabs the wire? Pull. Like my own wire? And then... Like my dinky wire? Oh, need a lift. Yeah. Go. Oh, it won't work. The handle's yeah. all the way over there. <laughs> How many people does it take to open the door? <laughs> Apparently just one, but we're not very good at it. Hey, that's no snow plow. They did the two sparks at your car. Why are you that close <laughs> to my face? <laughs> Get in the extreme shot. Okay. Alright, let me see if I remember how to do this. He's gonna smoke like this a sieve. a fucking choke. Are you sure you want to start it in here? It's gonna be pretty smoky. He was just sitting on her front end for a while. Yeah, we're fine. Alright. Oh no, dude, it's gonna smoke it's like gonna a smoke like a fucking chimney. <laughs> <laughs> they give you your vaping a friggin' run for its money. Oh. I'd rather inhale the baby. Yeah. <laughs> okay, we'll get a couple of these. Squirtle, squirtle. And one of these. Snowblower is ready for January when we get all of our fucking snow. Yay! Says the guy whose job is removing snow. It's all right. I got contracts. You can not snow all winter. Now. I hope it doesn't because snow can suck a fucking fat hairy one. Right? Wait, wait, hold on. What happened? Yeah. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, you're gonna. Yeah, suck his cock ring. Yeah. Fuck's sakes. Fuck. All right, good to go. Lovely. There, another project done. Now we just gotta wait for those capacitors to come in over at Mesco and get these monitors fixed. Wouldn't that be awesome? Anyway, people, I just had to do the uh, the mechanics. Uh, put it away, but <laughs> this is powdered laundry soap, and this is liquid dish soap. And you got the greatest way to take all the black off your hands after you've uh, worked on greasy as fuck items. <laughs> Um, I almost got it all off. My hands are... Okay, they're still pretty fucked, but whatever. I'm sure after tonight's shower, it'll all be gone. It's not like I work on this stuff every day, so they're not perma-stained, but... That's what you can do when you don't have that orange shit. You know, the orange shit for mechanic cleaning. It works. Gets the job done. Fuck it. But I just got Oreo outside right now. He's squeezing off a loaf. Uh, afterwards, I think I'm gonna shut the vlog down. It's 9 o'clock. Got a fart? Oh, grody. So, I'm gonna kill the vlog, boys. And we'll carry on tomorrow. I'm not sure what we're gonna do tomorrow. We'll figure it out then. But for now, I'm calling her quits. So, thanks for coming out. Hopefully you enjoyed the video. If you did, click the like button. A blower works awesome. It's like, I'm anxious now for the snow because I want to see how far it's gonna chuck it. So that should be pretty awesome. We'll figure that out. Uh, probably in January we'll get a good amount of snow where we can test that bitch out, but... We don't get any snow and we can't test it out. Hey, I'm okay with that. Because being on those roads when it snows, people are fucking dumb and accidents do occur. So if we can avoid snow this year, you know what? I won't even be shook. Thanks for coming out. Like, favorite, and comment as always. 
And until next time, people, keep on vlogging.